You know, being devoted to something means giving everything, everything that you have. And we give that to our family. We give that to the things that we, that we love to do. I mean, it's going to be an adventure every single day that we carry out into the outdoors or on the lake, on the ice. Each and everything that we do, we have that, that devotion. We can't thank the man above enough for what he's given us here and all these cool, awesome experiences that we have. That's, that's the true blessing that we really have in this whole thing. This is what you come for. <laughs> Lake Lewood muskies are so pretty. They get that green phase to them. That is probably the biggest pike I've ever seen, man. Okay, I'll go up. See you later, girl. Oh my gosh. Got him? Come here, right here, get ready. She's coming in hot. Yep. Coming in fast. Yep. Yeah. 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 Nice one. Do it. Nice one, babe. That's her. I'm oh pretty sure. God. Walleye fishing just holds a special place in my heart. It's the way I started fishing. I still love to walleye fish, even though we musky fish a lot, we still love to do the walleye fishing. I think most people have a special story when it comes to walleye fishing. You can find walleyes in a lot of different lakes around. They're widely populated. A lot of people have access to walleye fishing and a lot of people grow up walleye fishing, um, just as I did. Springtime walleye fishing can present a really good opportunity to catch fish, aggressive fish, shallow. All right, well, we just got out here to the first spot and we are gonna be jigging up some walleyes tonight. Beautiful night out, and uh, we are going to be using the Clam TG tungstens paired with a spot tail shiner. We're going to be jigging the sharp break lines here in about 6 to 12 feet of water. And uh, these fish are kind of, right now we marked some that are out deeper, and as the night goes on, these fish are going to move up towards this weed edge that we're fishing here. And um, there's been a lot of nice fish being caught right here, so um, we've been doing pretty well, and we're hoping to be able to put a few up here topside. So uh, we just got out here, uh, light wind, so perfect conditions for uh, doing this, and we're gonna fish well into the night. We might even transition into doing some trolling here in a little bit. Um, we like trolling after dark as well too, so we're gonna give this a shot for a bit We're gonna try jig a few up and then uh, and then yeah, we might transition in to do some trolling So should be a fun night and uh, I think we'll I think we'll find a few fish They're around Oh, yeah Real nice walleye. Here. Oh, yeah, baby Just marked him on the old side imaging. Oh, this is a good, this is good this fish. Is, yeah, oh, yeah, nice he's one. Fighting hard. Oh, yeah, real nice one Boom. Nice. Yeah, yeah. That's a good one. Well, I didn't take one. No. There you yeah. go. Get in there. Oh, the old pink and white. Old yep. classic pink and white. Oh, man, I set the hook right through the snow. <laughs> right through the snow. Got it right through there. Nice walleye to start the night off. Heck yeah. Take that one. Perfect. What a 
15 incher, 16 incher. Nice one. Nice walleye, yeah. Yeah, there's a Just got to there. the spot we're going to fish. We literally just started trolling along the edge um, with the mega side imaging, marked a nice school of fish right there. So we stopped and uh, threw on the old spot tail and bam, crushed it. So it's a good start to the night and there's a bunch more down there. So we're going to get down there. See you later. Nice girl. one. Yeah. Heck yeah, crush that. I love how you can feel those bites on this TG jig. It's yeah. just crazy. You can just feel them just tap it. It's a wall, it's a big one. It's really standing out, it's small head shakes. Yeah, it is. How's it going? Hi. Wow, whatever it is, it's, it's really standing out. It's big. It's fighting like a big wall. Yep, nice wall. Oh yeah, very nice. Real nice wall. <laughs> Look at it just staying down. Oh yeah, he's digging. It's heavy. Digging hard. It's a nice one. Yeah, it is. It's a really nice one. Ooh. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Bring him up here. Oh yeah, nice wall. Got him. Oh, All right, yeah, nice that's one. That's what we're looking for right there. <laughs> yeah. Beautiful. Wow. Oh, that's a gorgeous <laughs> one. Nice nut, Joe. Nice, Thank you. Honey. <laughs> nice work. Awesome. That's a beaut. Yeah, it is. The heavy one. Yeah. Man, he was dogging you hard. Oh man, just staying way down. Holy cow. He did not want to come up. Did he just his hammer it? Teeth off here. Yeah, I did. Nice. Yeah. Perfect. Wow, look at that. A TD drop jig. Wow, <laughs> he just smoked it and just stayed way down. Just big head shakes. Yeah, that's a thick walleye there. Those, yeah, are, nice those are those fun ones to catch, those big ones. That is awesome. <laughs> Heck yeah. Later. So we put a little time into uh, doing a little jigging over there and we just moved over to uh, one of our favorite trolling spots. So we just figured we'd pitch some jigs over here first for a little while and then we're gonna uh, make a few trolling passes into the night. So we're uh, just kind of finishing up, seeing if we can't pick up a few last ones jigging and then uh, yeah, we're gonna switch over to trolling mode. Early season walleye fishing is so much fun. Love catching walleyes, I love targeting them and one of our favorite ways to target them is trolling. You know, we like to troll for them because it's an easy way to cover ground and find those fish coming out from spawn. A lot of the areas that we like to target are the river mouths where these fish run up to spawn. They're actually getting done and they're all coming back. A lot of the males are still following those females. So usually where you find, you know, a couple fish, you're going to find a bunch of fish. And, you know, trolling after dark, it just seems like it's such a good reaction strike for those fish after they're trying to recover and, and they're looking for that really fast, quick meal. And it's a really relaxing way to just kick back. And, you know, we like to just sit there and pound on those walleyes trolling them. It's so much fun. Look forward to it every spring. And uh, it's just a lot of fun. All right, we just got out here and it is prime time and you could not ask for a more beautiful night to be doing some walleye trolling. We're out here, uh, up near Northern Minnesota we're gonna be long lining some, we got Northland Rumble Shads, which have been on fire um, so far this season. We're a couple weeks into, into the open water here and um, Ashley is going to be using, what are you gonna use? Flicker Shad. Flicker Shad, yeah, go figure. That's a that's a go, that's a go to it's for us too. for sure. So, um, so we're gonna be throwing a couple different things at them, but we're gonna be staying small, number five Flicker Shad and then I'm using the uh, um, medium size oh, rumble shell. And Ashley's actually on already, so <laughs> here we go. Good one? Yeah, it feels yeah, like a good one. Yeah, it like a good one. Heck yeah. Nice, perfect. Oh, oh, I just got off right at the Just net. got off. That's all right though, we just started. <laughs> that's so. all right, yeah, we just put our lines in the water and that's a good start, I'd say. Yeah, that's how it goes right there. <laughs> so that's what we're gonna be doing. We're uh, fishing in Oh, anywhere from four and a half to about seven feet of water. These fish were a couple weeks in now, and um, these fish are into their early season patterns. They're out of the rivers. They're staging in their early season patterns, chasing those smaller perch right now up shallow. And right now, 
the evening. This is one of our favorite times of year to fish walleyes. A, because we like to chase muskies, but B, because <laughs> it is nighttime and nighttime fishing this time of year is very, very effective pulling shad wraps. And it's one of our favorite things to do. Yep, it is. Yeah. So that's what we're going to do. That's the name of the game tonight is we're going to be trolling shad wraps, um, long lining, 1.6 to 1.8 miles an hour, four to seven and a half feet of water, smaller swim baits, number fives. And uh, yeah, we should have a good night and it should be should be a good night. Well, we already lost one. We just got out here and couldn't ask for a more beautiful night. No, it's perfect. Yeah. Nice night. Yeah. Nice night to catch some walleyes. Heck yeah. Still our first pass that we're making here. Is that another fish? Yes. Oh yeah. Nice. Nice eater. Perfect. Yeah, heck yeah. Nice. One for the flicker shad. Yeah, flicker shad's got one. What do you got on there? The purple and pink? Yeah, purple and pink. Yeah. Nice, nice eater. Yeah. Perfect eater. Got him? Put him off there, yeah. There you go. Pick Here's our first walleye of the night. We were just making our first pass there in about, we went out from about six feet into about seven and yeah, smack the, smack the flicker shad. First one on the board. First We're gonna throw walleye. it in the live well and gonna have, have him for supper. That's a perfect eater. Yeah. I love those little 14, 15 inches. Yeah, that's like fry the, perfect, up the best. perfect size to keep right yeah, there. Yeah, for sure. Trolling for walleyes is always a really good way to find a number of fish. Uh, we tend to catch quite a few uh, using this method, and it's a really good way if you're looking to put a meal on the table. Uh, a lot of times when we're out fishing, we don't keep a lot of fish, but when we're walleye fishing, we're, it's easier to, to kind of weed out and find that, that perfect slot range to put on the table. Yep, another nice eater. Perfect. Perfect. Thank yeah, you. that's what we're looking for. Nice. Awesome. There Heck you go. Yeah. Looks like I'm just going to be dedicated net man tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Another, both same size, perfect eater. If you're looking to keep fish, that's, we like those little bit smaller size. They fry up nice and crisp. Perfect uh, walleye there. Another good one. Yeah. We started off during opener and opener was really good. And uh, we were kind of focusing out in front of the river a little bit more. Now these fish are kind of filtering on down. And so we're just kind of chasing those, those schools. A little easier with the old uh, mega side imaging. It kind of takes the guessing out of it. So what we're doing is we're just cruising the shorelines, following that rubble, following where that bait fish is, and we're finding the baits where we're finding the fish. So pretty, pretty, uh, pretty sweet using that mega side imaging, finding them, marking them, and then just trolling back and forth on them. And and uh, well, it's been a great start. We're on pass number one. We got three fish, two in the box. So we're gonna keep on rolling here, and hopefully we have been catching some big ones. So. Um, the other night we ended up doubling up on a couple 25, 25 and a half or so. So hopefully we can pluck a couple of them too. And I came up a little shallower on that pass actually. On the old rumble shad. Look at this choke that thing. Look at that. Oh man. Another little guy? <laughs> I mean, what, what better thing to do yeah. than come out here and catch a bunch of wallets? Perfect. This little year? Yeah. Perfect year. I literally just got my line back out and wham! <laughs> Another one here. Yeah, it's crazy how many fish are in here right yeah, now. Yeah, just I mean, That was a little bit smaller. Heck yeah. Yeah, it's another nice one. Wow. Another good one. Another good eater. That was close to a double, huh? Yeah, that was close. They're just stacked right there. It feels a little better. Staying down a little bit. On the net? Uh, yeah, probably not on the net yeah. on this one. Yeah, this is a good one. Okay. There you go. Keep them. Nice. There you go. Hold them right there. A little bit nicer. Give the clam net a little workout. Oh, yeah. I'm giving it a workout tonight, <laughs> that's for sure. Nice walleye. Perfect. Yeah, these clam fortis nets are so nice for walleye fishing. Oh, perfect. They got that perfect, perfect scoop. They got the lock on there, so you can yeah. just lock her into place when you're going down. A lot of them. times, too, we extend that handle out, too, and it makes a big difference yeah, when you're trolling. So, for sure. But, yeah, nice walleye. Pretty.
Just your classic walleye right there, that I tell you what. Cutter. Just gorgeous. We've already got plenty in the box, so this one's lucky getting this gets a free pass today. <laughs> I like to use a line counter. Um, I like to keep my my consistency when I know that I'm at a certain depth. I'm um, going a certain speed and like I said right now we're trolling at 1.8 and I'm letting out 26 feet of line with this rumble shad and there's 26 right there and that's kind of seeming to be the magical spot so I'm going to stick stick with that and hope we can stick another one. Add another one. Nice babe. There you go, fling them in for you. Very nice eye. Got him. Heck yeah. Another nice one. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, She's this is so fun. Them. Just crushing walleye. Just going to walleye city Beautiful here. Night. <laughs> nice. Well, he got, he Thanks had for them grabbing all. that. Oh yeah, he had them all on there. Here you go. Sweet. Heck yeah. Nice. Another one. Another one. <laughs> They're liking it a little bit slower right now. Yeah, we kind of slowed down a little bit. Slowed and down a little bit there. Yeah. Another key to like too, that. like another thing that you can do too that works really good is actually taking and like when we're going slower like this, I like to pump my rod. Yes. You kind of surge that bait a little bit and then you drop it back in their face. And a lot of times, especially when you're trolling like this, it's a reaction bite anyway. So if you sit there and you pump it a little bit, they uh, that bait kind of slams back into their face and it seems to get a, a lot more, you know, a lot more trigger action going on them. Yeah, so, I've been doing that a lot too. Yeah. It's like the second you kind of give it a tug and let it pause and they'll hammer yep. it a lot of times. Hammer it, mm -hmm. yeah, for sure. That reaction bite yep. gets in the trigger. Yep, heck yeah. Dogging it pretty good. Yeah. The old Minnesota gold. Oh yeah. Nice walleyes. So fun, just feeling them smoke that thing. Yeah, it is. Yeah, we got enough for the family, so we're gonna throw him back. Enough for a meal and let the rest go. Yeah. yeah. Oh, 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 buddy. That didn't take long. No, huh, oh, man. Oh, it's a good one, too. Really good one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's his eyeballs back here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nice. Nice. <laughs> nice job. That's a good one. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Heck nice yeah. One. Just got up here. Um, we just moved spots again. Um, came over to the spot that we were catching some nicer fish jigging. So we thought we'd come back out here and troll them after dark. And uh, that didn't take long, huh? No. <laughs> I'm glad we made that move. So Me too. that's nice fish. Super nice fish. Man, that thing just crushed it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Hammered it. You didn't even know what I was going on. I saw him on side imaging. I was like, oh, yeah. there's one right there. Yeah, we there. saw him, saw him on whale. side imaging. <laughs> Look how gold he is. Man, that's a pretty fish. Super gold. Cool. Well, that didn't take long, no, huh? Oh, nice job. All right, well, let's get him back and get some more. Oh. Nice. You know, one of the things is, is like sometimes you'll be trolling at night like this and you'll have them miss it. And one of the things I like to do is I like to drop it back to them right in their face and a lot of times they'll come back and they'll smash it just like that one did he actually hit it missed it i dropped it right back into his face and he just crushed it so um you know if, if you miss them just give them that extra little chance to hit it again because they will hit it again and uh just like that one did heck yeah let's go let's get back out there. there's a pile of them in here mm -hmm. everybody guy big oh, wall wow nice big wall big wall oh yeah baby Oops. Careful. Hang on. <laughs> there you go, babe. Right there. There we go. Oh, man. Look at that pig. <laughs> nice yes. one. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, Sweet. buddy. Oh, that's a nice walleye that right is. there. Awesome. Heck yeah, hold him right there. Okay. He barely helped on his lip. Oh. Hold on there, bud. All right. Heck yeah. Nice walleye. Nice one. Look at that, babe. That's awesome. Gosh, that thing just pounded it. Wow, oh, yeah. <laughs> that was awesome. Yeah, it was. <laughs> we thought we were on bottom for a second there. Yeah. Thing uh, crushed it and it oh. just dead weight. That's a beauty walleye. What do you think? Yeah, of that? it is. 
That's Man. super nice. Yeah, we were just looking at the time. We were just about to head out, and we're like, we'll make one more pass. So, yeah, yeah that's a cool. good one to end it on. That's huh? a really good one to end it on. <laughs> Man, that's, that's a, nice a big walleye. Awesome. I'll what? tell you what, coming out here, jigging, <laughs> trolling, it's that time of year right now where you can just you can hammer these fish any mm -hmm. which way. Um, we caught some really nice fish jigging, yep. and uh, now we transitioned into trolling after dark, which mm -hmm. is kind of our favorite thing to do. It's peaceful, and uh, you know the fish seem to really react to that reaction bite um, after dark with with trolling the rats. Yeah, they do. So. Yeah, and it's kind of fun too because you know the, there's a lot of commotion during the day, and pretty soon everybody kind of filters out at the night and you're yeah. the only ones left and yep. catching walleyes so it's fun. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> nice yep. walleye dander. Nice job. All right, cool. We'll get her back. And... All right. All right. See you later, Chasing walleyes is always a fun option nice. that we enjoy doing. We've, right. you know, been doing it since we're kids. I grew up on Lake of the Woods. You did it with your dad and mom and, and it's just something that, you know, everybody really gets exposed to is walleye fishing. Mm -hmm. It's always a fun time when you hit the water and knowing you're gonna knowing you're gonna catch some walleye. So another great time on the water together and uh, yep. yeah, it's a yeah. lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. Let's see what this new day brings back on the road.